All right, so this is a walkthrough of installing the um, 3.5 beta on Macs. Um, I've gone to the process of downloading, so um, updated the installer. Installer is always the biggest hassle. Um, just go ahead and run the piece, and it will do all of the things that needs to happen. Uh, this is an older machine, so it's going to take a second for it to finish the installation. Um, let's see here. Forward, forward. Do, do, do. Get this installed. Um, do, 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 do. And then once it's installed, um, the program will be uh, in your um, apps directory, like previous versions. Uh, this is not in have Mark Edit 3 or Mark Edit 2 installed. It won't remove them. So it's been installed. Let's get rid of that. All right, so let's go through here and see what gets done. All right, so we go to Launchpad. That's the new. Um, beta version of Mark Edit 3.5. Go ahead and click on it. Keep it in my dock there. Uh, so the first thing it's going to do is it's going to um, check and see if you have Mark Edit 3 installed. And if you do, it's going to pull that content um, into uh, the application and then start the uh, first run wizard. So that way, in theory, if you had any configurations previously, um, it will pull them over and take care of them. Um, so it went ahead and did that, pulled them over. So here's the, the wizard. We see the um, all this stuff. We'll go ahead and just uh, say set it up. And we're good to go. And there you go. So now Mark Edit is installed. And uh, you'll see the front page has changed a little bit. You'll see there's some other changes. I'm slowly moving through the application and bringing new functionality, but essentially what the beta does is it brings all of the changes that were made in Mark Edit 7.5 on the library side into the application. And then there are just some places where I'm starting to uh, tweak the UI so that um, they will be available for use. And so in the old version of Mark Edit, OCLC operations were there, so you can see they've been picked up. Um, so you can start using them. So uh, that's kind of how it works. So happy editing. And if you run into problems, and I fully expect you will, um, uh, let me know.